Could the first African Grand Slam winner emerge at Wimbledon 2024? Let's dive into the inspiring journey of Tunisian tennis star An Jaber, who is ready to make history. Welcome to AU News. Today, we're delving into the story of An Jaber, her special bond with the Princess of Wales, and her quest for a Grand Slam victory. Last year's heartbreak on Jabber's defeat in last year's Wimbledon final was a heartbreaking moment, not just for her, but also for the Princess of Wales. Kate Middleton, a passionate tennis fan, empathized deeply with Jabber's tears as Czech Republic's Marketa Vondrusova lifted the Venus Rosewater dish. A historic achievement in 2022, Jabber made history as the first North African, Arab, and Muslim woman to reach a Grand Slam final. Despite the defeat, her dignified speech and resilience won hearts, including Kate's, who has been a pillar of support for Ons. Kate's support Ons shared with Hello Magazine how Kate's support has been a significant motivator. After her loss, Kate repeatedly checked on her and offered comforting hugs. Jabber said, her kindness and energy were amazing. Kate's health and uncertainty There's uncertainty around Kate's attendance at Wimbledon 2024 due to her cancer treatment. Ons wished her a speedy recovery, expressing gratitude for the princess's past support during her struggles. Determined for victory, Jabber is back at Wimbledon with renewed determination. She described her previous defeat as the most painful loss of her career, but vowed to come back stronger and win a Grand Slam. Modesty and controversy, Ons also made headlines with her modest clothing choice at Wimbledon last year, initially breaching the dress code. She quickly corrected this and is ready to comply while aiming for victory. Early life and rise growing up in Sousse, Tunisia, Ons faced limited tennis facilities but was driven by her parents' sacrifices and her early talent. Her mother's unwavering support helped her pursue her dreams. Cultural impact Ons is not just a tennis player but a trailblazer for African and Arabic women. She's been featured on magazine covers and received awards for her contributions to sport. Jabber hopes to inspire the next generation of players. Personal Life On's husband, Kareem Kamoun, has been her personal trainer since 2017. Their supportive relationship is a cornerstone of her career, and Kareem is often seen cheering her on during tournaments. That's a wrap for today's video. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comments below. My channel name is AU News. Thanks for watching.